Hey guys, so this video is going to be a nail polish favorite, but spring and summer nail polishes. So if you guys didn't know, I love doing my nails. I do my nails pretty much every single week. Um, I just, I'm obsessed with it. I have a ton of nail polishes that I've collected over the years and I feel like because of that, I have gotten to know a lot about nail polish and just nail trends and just things like that. And also I've developed my favorite things for my nails to do with my nails like pol nail polishes over the year so I just wanted to share that with you and share my favorite polishes that I wear pretty much all spring and summer long and I just thought I would make this video to kind of share with you guys if you were thinking you know you want to get some more spring and summer colored polishes and you didn't know what to get so Anyway, enough rambling, let's just get on to the video. So, um, I do wear quite a lot of pinks on the in the summer and the spring. Pink is my favorite color, so I have quite a few shades, so I think I'll get to those first. And the first one I have is this one from Maybelline Color Show, and it's in the color Chiffon Chic, um, number 160, and it is just this really pretty pinky bubblegum kind of color. I liked it because it was like bright, <laughs> light but bright, and... I don't know, I really like it. Pretty good quality too for a drugstore nail polish. Um, I do have my favorite nail polish brands, but I'm not opposed to trying others. But this one for a drugstore brand, I really like it. It was inexpensive, I'm not exactly sure of the price. I really like it. I just like how it's like bubblegummy color, but not super bubblegummy. It's more on the like lighter toned down side. Another pink that I have here is a very light kind of nude kind of pink and this is from the brand Butter London and this is called Teddy Girl and this nail polish brand is very expensive. I have quite a few nail polishes from them but they are very expensive. This was about $18. I got it at Bendel's in New York City but you can find them at Sephora and online too, obviously. I like these nail polishes. They're not my absolute favorite but I do still like them. I liked them enough to buy like six of them and I love this color it's super light and I actually have a polish in here that I love but it's very sheer and I'll talk about that next but this one I got because it's the same type of color but it's more opaque and so I really like this so I'm I, I buy a lot of these colors just because the one that I'm gonna talk about next is one of my favorite colors but it's so sheer and hard to put on I try to look for an opaque match to it that it's just easier I can put on in two coats and that's it so this one is definitely a good choice for that I really like it and if you're willing to spend a little bit a little bit a lot more on nail polish I would definitely try this out and sometimes you may be able to find it in like a TJ Maxx or Marshalls for a cheaper price so keep your eyes on the lookout for that too or Sephora on sale maybe I'm not really sure um, but if you are willing to spend almost $20 on a nail polish I would definitely look at look into this so the one that I was talking about previously is this one by Etsy and it's in the color ballet slippers I love this I think it's such a beautiful color although it is very very sheer and it's just very transparent I sometimes will put up to like five coats of this on and I've learned how to put them on like you have to just put like a bunch of thin coats you cannot make it thick because then it'll get too big like too thick on your nail and just looks and feels horrible but I absolutely love the color I think it's so beautiful I wear this when I just feel like having something very light on my nail. This is probably my like 10th bottle of this. Like I just, I love this nail polish. I wear it to death in the spring of the summer and I really like it. Essie is one of my favorite nail polish brands too. So um, the only problem with this is that it's very sheer. And so like I said before, I try to buy like more op transparent, more opaque, <laughs> that's the word, more opaque dupes of it. So I've been looking, I haven't found the best one yet, but I found a lot of nice light pink nail polishes in the process. This one is by OPI, which is my favorite um, nail polish brand and it's called Sweetheart. I bought this last year. I saw this, I think on Instagram. I think I saw someone wearing this on an Instagram post or in a YouTube video showing this new collection, I think. I can't remember which one, but I saw it and I fell in love with it and I got it and it's so pretty. It's this light, it, it's not like sheer or like um, anything. There's no seat like um, glitter in it or anything. I really like it. It's just this really pretty light pink color. I have a good dupe for this one if you want something a little bit more opaque. 
Um, but again, I really like it. Also love OPI. Another pink. Wow, I have more pinks than I thought. I have here is this one by Essie and it's called Boom Boom Room. This is so fun. I wear this on vacation a lot. For the past few years, I've been in this for vacations. It's just this really, really fun, bright pink. Kind of along the lines of this, but not as bubblegummy in color. This one is just more of a, I don't know, like just a fun, I guess cotton candy pink. I would say it's closest to. So fun, so bright, so and perfect for like a beach day or a beach vacation. I've been really, really loving this color for the summertime, especially vacations and going to the beach because it's just one of those fun colors that looks really good with a tan. And another kind of more cotton candy type pink is this one by Nicole by OPI and it's called Carnival Cotton Candy and this one is from the Carrie Underwood collection. I, I like this color, again, super bright, super fun. Not as bright as Boom Boom Room, but still really fun for the spring and the summer. And again, this one will look good with a tan. And yeah, I just really love bright, fun colors for the summer. And this one definitely goes with that. And the last pink I have is more of a darker pink. I actually have it on my nails right now. And this is by China Glaze, which I would say OPI, Essie, and China Glaze are my three favorite nail polish brands. And this one is called Rich and Famous. Again, this is another one that I think is really fun for the beach and just the summer, like vacation in general. It does look good with a tan too. And I just think it's so fun. If you like more darker pinks, um, I think this one's a good choice. I really, really like it. It reminds me of nail polishes that I wore when I was little. It's very nostalgic for me too, this color. Like this was the color that I wanted on my nails when I was little. So I really like that. And yeah, I really love China Glaze too. So next we have two that are pretty similar. They're more coral, but I liked both of them that I wanted to put them in. So the first one I'm going to talk about, oh, they're both by OPI by the way. The first one I'm going to talk about is called My Chihuahua Bites. And again, it's this like red, orange, color yeah this one's more of a red orange the other one's more of a coral this one is so fun and again like i keep saying it's great for like vacation or like the beach and a lot of the colors i would say that's why i choose them for the summer because they look good with a tan and they look good when you're at the beach or um like on vacation they're just really fun for vacation or the beach because they look good when you have a tan and so i really like this one but i really um like to put this on my toes i like getting this for pedicure for the summer and then another one that's like i said really similar is this one called opi on collins avenue and i got this a few years ago and this was um, one that I used for a vacation a few years ago and I really liked it Again, I like this for my toes too, but um, this one's more it is a red orange But I would say there's a little bit more coral in it I could be wrong, but I I think that it's like a little bit more corally than the other one and I think it's so fun I just OPI also has the best name so I tend to buy OPI nail polishes not just for the color but just because the name is so fun but I really like this again it's really nice um on vacation on the beach when you are nice and tan another one that looks nice when you have a tan is this one by Essie called real shopper actually this is the wrong one but this one's really nice too but there's actually one that I meant to grab so I'm gonna go grab that really okay so this is actually the one I meant to grab instead of this because they look so similar. As you can see, I do have a lot of similar colors in my nail polish collection, and that just happens when you are collecting nail polishes for years, and you sometimes forget which ones you have. One that I wanted to show you, which looks a little weird because it's been lying on its side, and one side looks a little bit strange. Okay, so this one is called Tarte Deco, and again, it's by Essie. Very similar to this one, Cereal Shopper but more on the pastel -y light side and I love this one. Actually, I found this one because I think my cousin was wearing it and my mom asked what color it was because she really liked it and then we went out and bought it and this one looks great for, on a pedicure. I really like using on a pedicure. This, my mom uses more than I do, but I really, really like it. It's just so fun and again, like looks really good when you are nice and tan. Next, I have this yellow color and this one's by Orly and I'm not sure what the name oh it's called lemonade I like it because it's light and more pastel-y yellow I have a yellow from Nicole by OPI from the Selena Gomez collection and that one is like bright like yield sign yellow and I like it but not much like sometimes I'll put it on if I want something really bright but I tend to not put it on I use it more for nail art and I like this for like the spring and maybe like Easter time Next, we have one of my favorite nail polishes I've had this for a long time now but I love it 
so much and it is this china glaze nail polish and it is called for audrey and it's this beautiful tiffany blue color as you can see i don't know if you can see but this behind me is a picture of audrey hepburn i love audrey hepburn also love breakfast at tiffany's and so this was my first um, China Glaze nail polish because I was looking for a Tiffany blue nail polish a long long time ago many years ago when I was still in high school and I came across this one and I bought it and I love it I really like it I haven't found another Tiffany blue nail polish that I liked as much as this one it's very bright and very fun for the spring and the summertime so next we have another more pastel -y kind of color and this one is by Essie and it is called absolutely sure this one, it's really fun. I really like it. I think it's really nice for the springtime. Also, another one that I grabbed instead of another one. Should have really looked at the names of these. <laughs> so I'm gonna go grab that. So this is the one that I meant to grab, and this one is by Essie, and it's called Mint Candy Apple. Even though it's a more blue color, when I would assume that Mint Candy Apple would be like a green, it's still like a really pretty pastel blue color. I like this for not only the spring but the summertime because even though it is pastel and I kind of associate pastel with spring it's still really bright and fun for the summer OPI color and it's called I can only wear OPI I was looking for a light gray color and I was just browsing Dwayne Reed um, and I found it. it's very bright and simple I put this on when I just want something very clean and very simple and I you know don't want to focus too much on my nails and then the last one is one that I wore a lot uh, this past summer and the summer before that and it's just plain old white this one's by OPI called Alpine Snow but of course you can use whatever white nail polish you have they're pretty much all the same I just really love white during summer I think it's so bright and fun and I really like it. I actually wore this um, on my vacation to London. So those are all of my favorites for the spring and the summer. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, give it a big thumbs up. I'll leave a comment down below letting me know your favorite nail polishes that you like to wear during the spring and summer or if you've tried any of these and you really like them, let me know. If you like this video, um, please subscribe and check out my channel for more videos. I upload every single Tuesday and sometimes I'll throw in an extra video on Thursday. Hope you enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching.